So welcome back to my channel and for you guys today I have the Rudder Dye Tag and I am doing a collab with my girl Pretty D. What's up girl? So Jacqueline Hill was the one that created this tag. Um, I know there's other tags that it's like the similar thing but I just want to do this tag and yeah I'm doing it with my girl. Hopefully you guys check her out. I'll be leaving her link down below in the description box. So go show her some love and yeah let's get to it. Mwah. So my Rider Die foundation would have to be hands down the Milani to win a one. It is a concealer and foundation and I am in the color natural and this is has to be my hands down favorite foundation. Like it leaves my face feeling so fresh and I don't know I just really really like it. It is medium coverage. It does cover most of my face but if you put another coat on it girl you doing good and I love it like if you haven't tried this foundation do so I do recommend it it just feels so fresh and it's lightweight it is not that heavy like others I know the one the like the Mac one that I do have it I just feel like really really heavy and with that one I sometimes I feel that it's really really cakey but with this one I do not have travel at all and I just love it and mostly for the summer because you know like there's the heat and you know like you feel like your face is all melting with all the foundation but with this girl I love it so I do recommend this and for my concealer I've tried the elf the Maybelline and I think it has to be the cover girl but the one that really really worked for me was the Maybelline the H the instant witch the instant age rewind and as you can tell, I'm almost done with it, and this is my second bottle, and I love it. I do go back to it every single day. I mean, if there was like a fire or something, I think this would be the first thing that I would get. Because sometimes I don't want um, foundation. I just use this like under my eyes and like where I have acne or whatever, and that's it. So, yeah, this is my hands-on right eye concealer. I love it, and I do recommend it. So, yeah. And then for setting my face, like I don't know, like I just found out that I don't know. Well, I'm not a. I wasn't aware of like if I was oily or a dry skin, but I am learning. So yeah. So now I do know that on my T zone I am oily, and I don't know if you guys seen my videos like when I started. Like I think it was the Bath and Body Works. Like my face looks really, really oily. Like so. Yeah, I had a friend that told me, you know, like, I think you're really from your T-Zone, and I am. And ever since I bought this L'Oreal Inflammable Pro Matte, this has helped me not to look really, really oily. So I am loving this. Anybody that is oily, I do recommend this. Like, I really love it. I do have the foundation, but I love their powder. So, yeah. And for my Rider Die blush, it has to be the Milani one. As you can tell, like I use it and it's already really like faded out. But it is in the Barry Amore 03. And it's a gorgeous color, like it's a baked blush and I love it. I go back to it a lot, like hands down, my favorite. So yeah, so if anybody I mean you should go try it out, you know. You never know. But yeah. And then for my ride or die primer it has to be the hard candy i've never worn a primer before and when i started um seeing other youtube videos like i was checking out like what's the setting spray like what's a primer like what's a concealer you know all that stuff and i found the one the hard candy one and oh my god i loved it like i have the benefit um primer and the um, the baby skin one and I love this one like I keep going back to this you know that I use it a lot because my daughter broke it but I mean it still has some a little bit and I am gonna finish it and I'm gonna buy another one so yes I do recommend this I haven't used it like for a while now but the time that I've been using it it's been awesome and it helps my foundation look flawless it does not move it does not cake up and it's all thanks to this beauty right here so yeah so if you guys haven't used it i do recommend for you guys to use it 
and it's not even that expensive it's like about seven eight bucks at Walmart so yeah and for my rider dye mascara it is the ultra clean or kahel this is a Mexican mascara this is my favorite I've used this during my middle school and high school and I will never stop using it because I love it so much I love the wand it's big fluffy makes my 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 eyelashes <laughs> look really pretty obviously I can't talk but yeah looks really 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 pretty I love it and it's not that expensive it is like $1.99 or $2.99 so yeah so if you guys have that little Mexican market go pick it up I do recommend it for those that have trouble like picking up your eyelashes and looking at them all fleek I do recommend this mascara and for my um, Rider Dye lip products I have two like a lip gloss and a matte one for my matte one I would have to go with the LA colors and it's in the um, Let's kiss and it's like a nudish color like a pink pink undertone. I love it I don't normally look like this every single day because no, but when I'm like in a hurry and Don't want to put anything else like I do put this and I love it like it's a little bit sticky I am not gonna lie, but if you put like Like a setting powder which I use a wet and wells Fergie this way right here And I just put like a little bit of dab on it girl you on the go and yeah I love it I recommend it it's not that expensive so yeah and for my lip gloss like you know like you're in the house and don't want to look all ugly or whatever I've been using this all through my high school and I love it it's the Victoria's Secret lip gloss most of you guys know that Victoria's Secret sells makeup and I've always buy these I love it and yeah like I have so many others but this is the one that I always grab too and take with me so yeah my rider dye and then for my rider dye highlight it would have to be the wet and wild I love this baby I didn't even know what was a highlight I was like what is that but when I bought this like it made it different and I love it I do have others but I keep going back to this baby And then for my Rider Dye setting spray, it would have to be the Maybelline Master Fix. I love this. Like, it makes me feel really, really fresh. It does not, um, when I put it on, like, my makeup doesn't move for hours. Obviously, if you're in the heat, it's, you know, it's gonna go away. But, like, since I'm sometimes at home, like, you know, like, my, um, foundation stays put with this and it helps. And yeah, I really love it and I do recommend it as well so for any of you guys that want to try it. I do recommend it. So yeah. So for my Rider Dye setting powder for my eyes would have to be the Ultra Plus Press setting powder. And it's in the color Banana and Girl. I love this stuff. This is my second one that I do buy and I love it. And it just makes a really big difference. In my eyes, I can make some pop more. So yeah, I'm really liking it, and I do recommend it. Like I wouldn't leave without this baby right here. So yeah. And for my Rider Dye palette, I have so many palettes, but I think the one that I go to most is like this one right here. Like it is from Claire's, and I've been having this. I did receive it for a Christmas gift, and these are the colors that I do use the most, which is the neutrals. So yeah, so this is my favorite palette. I do use it and this is the one that I would take with me like if anything would happen, you know. So that's my Rider Dye palette. And for my Rider Dye eyeliner, liquid eyeliner would be the one in Wild one. Like, I love this stuff. Like, I've been using stuff forever. I know the formula has changed and the packaging, but I still go back to it and I buy it and I keep rebuying. I do have a backup one, so yeah. I love this and I think that is it for my ready dye items I hope you guys like this video and yeah I'll be tagging some of my friends I'll put them somewhere here or in the description box but yeah the people that I do tag for my to see their ready dye video is makeup by Connie, Walaska, Torres, Kathleen, 
Beauty by Gabby, Marlene Soto, and Cinta Aleman. Girls, I want to see you guys' video. And yeah, just have fun. And if you guys like this video, give it a big thumbs up. And if you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe so you won't miss any of my videos. And yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.